cybersecurity is critical to your business. The ransomware attacks, they have exploded by 300% in the last 12 months, and they led to a 30% increase in insurance prices. So what's the impact on the use of mobile solutions? Andre Sondkin, he's the general manager enterprise business at HMD Global, the home of Nokia phones. And he's here to share his view on this market changes. Welcome, Andre. Thank you, Roland. Great to be here. Great to have this chat. And we see this explosion of ransomware attacks. We see the rise of insurance prices. So what's the impact of these trends on the use of mobile solutions? Sure. No, great question. And when we're looking at enterprise market as a whole, the way we, we see it is that we have um, personal use case scenarios or personal mobility. We have uh, various industry verticals using mobile devices, and those could be healthcare, could be transport and logistics, just to name a few. And also we have the increased use of commercial off-the-shelf devices in various IoT use cases. And I believe all these three have, have their specific needs um, from the use case perspective, but also from security as well as privacy perspective. And, and as we have unfortunately witnessed, there's been an increasing number of, of, um, of, of threats and, and incidents, for instance, in the healthcare sector, which has created um, a lot of trouble for the, the healthcare organizations, a lot of cost when it comes to, to managing those incidents. And, and from, um, from our perspective as HMD and, and the home of Nokia phones and, and uh, HMD Enterprise Solutions, what we want to offer is, is a, a um, secure and, and a great solution to address that part of that chain to ensure that the phones, the Nokia phones, and also the HMD solutions that enterprise might be using are at the top of the security by providing security updates, but also providing latest Android upgrades so that all those uh, latest um, security enhancements to the Android platform have been. Um, um, properly taken into into use, and, and we offer that experience then for enterprise users. So, so this is these are the kind of areas where enterprise customers, to to our experience, pay a lot of attention. They want to be sure that that they take all the precautions that they can within their their possibilities, and, and this is the the offering that we want to then provide to them across multiple price points, so they can choose the solutions that work best for them. And you're talking about healthcare. You talk about IoT type of solutions. Can you share some examples and best practices how these enterprises are using enterprise mobility management solutions and how they keep their environment secure? No, absolutely. So, if we we think about um, mobile device management or enterprise mobility management or EMM as they're called, um, only maybe fifteen to twenty percent of all enterprise devices today are um, are managed with such a solution. However, that number is, is increasing over 20% per year uh, for the foreseeable future globally, which shows how much um, enterprises are, first of all, needing such solutions to enable productivity, but also security um, in their environments and, and for their employees, but also for their, their mission critical activities. And, and we're seeing that the, the um, EMM solutions are being adopted more and more um, as, as, we, as we move forward. And, and um, one of the, the examples of, of such solution is, is our HMD Enable Pro EMM solution. And, and if we look at the, the kind of um, threats that enterprises are seeing and, and what we're, we're kind of witnessing in the, in the, um, in the market is that the, the um, application stores such as Google Play Store is becoming more and more secure. So there are less and less risks of, of um, finding potential harmful applications from there. However, the, the risk is then shifting more into third-party stores or perhaps sideloading of applications. And, and this, this starts to be the majority of the, the kind of risk that our company are seeing. So with an EMM solution, for instance, it's possible for enterprises to block use of third-party uh, stores or, or download installing applications from unknown sources. And that's one example of how companies can, can benefit EMM solutions for additional security and and, uh, and protection of devices and therefore their, their mission critical activities. Yeah, and with this increase in ransomware attacks in mind and, and looking into the future for cybersecurity for mobile solutions, so what type of foundation should organizations have to stay secure in the coming months, coming years ahead? So if we, we think about how, how um, we all have been 
working from from outside the office, home office, um, work is is the norm, and and for many it's probably going to be the norm going forward, or hybrid work between office office and and and, um, and, and home. That means that companies need to prepare for that enhanced uh, number of mobile devices and, and people working from from um, places which is not the office where you can you know support people with IT help. You can have protected networks and so forth. So I think first first point is to educate users of what risks there are. You know, not to use um, wireless LAN networks which are public, for instance, to transfer your credit card information or, or such information that could then be be exploited. Uh, the other thing then is to um, implement solutions that help remote work, such as an EMM solution, which then enables uh, with Android devices, um, such as the work profile, which then allows personal apps and work apps to be separate in, in one single device, but still in a way that it's comfortable for the end user to use. And it makes makes um, use of such devices much, much more um, easy and, and, and more more enjoyable while still still protecting that personal data and ensuring that that uh, main risks are being being avoided if you think about the iot use cases and, and iot devices are typically not really you know personal devices so they don't have a personal identity they reside in a certain location they're being used for a specific purpose which may be just transferring data or it may be giving input to a specific question every now and then and, and such devices benefit from a secure connection. So I think the trend is to move away from wireless LAN use for multiple reasons. But one of the benefits of using a cellular connectivity, which could be a, a data roaming IoT SIM card a solution, such as HMD Connect Pro, as an example, um, is that it provides that additional layer of security when the data is protected. It can be routed through the secure APNs. And overall, it can ensure a continuous service in a secure way. So user um, education, having the right tools and the right solutions to ensure um, security and, and, um, and good user experience for the personal use cases, and then looking at, at uh, protecting the end-to-end -end connectivity for IoT. Those would be my, my recommendations for companies to consider. And I really like that you mentioned user education as well, because it's so important that the users know what to do and what not to do. It's not only technology, but it's good to see that the technology advances, advancements are really there at rapid pace. Thank you, Andre, for your, your insights. And thank you to the audience and looking forward to seeing you next time.